25 facts about me. It's me, Isha, and welcome back to my YouTube channel! Sobrang tagal ko na talagang gusto gumawa ng YouTube videos ulit. So, sobrang na-miss ko siya, and I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, guys. Sobrang talaga akong naging busy with all my ganaps in life. Pero ito na nga po talaga. Ito na po yung official video ko na I'm going to be back for legit na legit na talaga guys legit na legit legit na babalik and for today's video I haven't really done any talagang introduction about me and this channel and so today I'm going to give you guys 25 facts about me first my name is Trisha Marie Quintos Kalimutan I am 25 years old I was born on the 20th no I was born on December 22 1994 my favorite number is 23. As in, um, LeBron James, kanya. not because of LeBron James, but I just really love number 23. Hello, we all have our favorite numbers. My family, childhood friends, and some of my friends call me Yes. That's my nickname. Alam ko, sobrang wala siyang connect sa Tersha, but hindi rin po ako pinanganak sa Japan. Because I have two birth certificates. Yung isa is yung dati kong name, which is Secret! <laughs> Tapos yung dati kong name, three names siya. Yung first two names na lang. Doon siya nakuha, yung yen. So pag sinabi mo yung name ko, it's okay. my name. My other name is Carol Ian. So when you say Carol Ian, para siyang may sound na yes. Carol Ian. Huh? Diba? So yun, so dun siguro nagsimula kung bakit ako tinatawag na yun ng family wow. members ko. Paano naman nag-come up yung Trisha? Kasi nung bata ako, since they always call me yes, and I kinda don't like it nung bata ako, pero no, I, I like May it. mga tawag pa sila yun, like mayroon siya tawag na mo yeng yeng, ganyan. So parang feeling ko ang pangit, parang ano yun? <laughs> parang hindi bagay sa at. Mayroon akong lakalaro nung bata, ang pangalit alam niya Trisha. Tapos so, sobrang ganda, parang Trisha. Ganyan, Trisha. Tapos so, sabi ko kay mommy, Ma, pwede mong Trisha na lang din name ko. Yung ganyan. So, ayun. Nangyari, Trisha mali nga. Ewan ko rin kay mommy, ba't siya pumaya? Pero, ang aking height ay 5'3". Yan. Number 7. Nung college ako, I joined a beauty pageant. Two times, to be exact. First is for our school or our course. And then, nanalo ako doon, tapos lumaban ako sa inter-college na, or Miss Mabua. So, ayun. So, not everyone knows that. And, if you guys don't know, I'm a very shy person. So, hindi ko rin in-expect. Kung pumasok ako ng Mabua, nasasali ako ng beauty pageant. Sumali lang talaga ako doon for fun. And, tada! Yun, I had to go on a diet and all of those things. Number 8, I was born and raised here in the Philippines, Manila, Philippines. Pero, fact number 9, I was born and raised in a two-culture setting. Two-culture se setting kasi my mom's a Filipino but my stepdad's a Korean. So, your culture in Korea and culture in the Philippines, the Philippines put together in one house and that's it. So, may times na nakuha ko yung pagbabaw, bigay ng food na dalawang hand sa Korean culture. Fact number 10, I am a multimedia artist. Not like Tony Gonzaga, a multimedia artist. Um, I'm knowledgeable in video editing, photography, um, graphics, graphic designing, and a lot of things. And I graduated in Mapua, Institute of Technology, now called Mapua University. I used to work for weddings and events video cover so video video production. So um the work for Hello Info, Hi Boss PB. And I'm really grateful for my mentor, my first ever girl boss at the PB. I learned a lot of things from her, how to be from Malinas in the shots, how to do SDEs and a lot of things. So, fact number 12. I lived in Canada for three months long. I said nag fail you. Visa ko. Fact number 13, guys. 13. I traveled to a lot of countries that includes Hong Kong, Canada, US, China, South Korea, Bali or Indonesia, Thailand, and Nepal. Sobra talaga ako na enjoy sa mga iba-ibang cultures. 
ng iba't ibang bansa. Passionate about traveling and culture, learning culture of other countries, ganyan. Fact number 14. Love makeup and the beauty of shade. Yun nga, kung nakita mo sa dati kong mga videos here sa YouTube channel, I used to do beauty vlogs and do my makeup. 15. Just recently, I have to admit that I became an army. I love BTS. Sobra. Asin kanina, I was talking to my cousins about it. Para talagang yung mata ko. Alam mo nito sparkle. Next to sparkle. This is my heart heart sa likod ko. Ganyan. Ganyan ko talaga sila ka daw. Fact number 16. Ang pet peeve ko ay people who chew loudly. Yung... I don't get it. I don't know. Although ako, alam ko naman. I admit na may time kasi kang I chew loudly. Pero alam mo yung cultures pa rin ako somehow. So I like... Ganyan. 17. I love to clean. Yung cleaning therapy. As in, yung mag-wipe ka, mag-mop ka, ayusin mo, declutter your stuff. Um, napanood ko na yung Marie Kondo. And 18. I love to dance before. Ngayon kasi, hindi na ako siya nakakapag-practice. Zumba-zumba na lang. Ganyan. Dati, naging part pa ako ng cheer dance um, team namin noong high school. And I also love to um, do hip-hop. Ganyan. Before. 19. Fave color. I would say black and white, but you know, black is the absence of color and white then ata. Huh? So they're not considered colors though. So I would say that one of my favorite colors now is mustard or teal and pink or nude. Mga ganyan. Yan yung mga favorite ko colors ngayon. Fact number 20. I'm a swimmer. I used to be a swimmer. Every summer, I like, swimming classes. Ako, ganyan. Tapos ko kong sumalas ng swimming competition. Uh, actually, nanalo ko na isang trophy. Wow. Pero sa ano yun? Swimming, ano kayo? Swimming lesson. Wow. Pero trophy pa rin siya. I'm proud of it. Nanalo ko siya ko first place, guys. Favorite kong stroke? Butterfly. <laughs> 21. You know what? I can't survive a day without having coffee. Kahit mainit or iced coffee. I love coffee. I love it. Mga dream ko din talaga na soon or in the future, ma-handle ko na black coffee. Kasi ngayon, um, ang gusto ko lang is yung brown or brown or creamy. Hindi ko pa kaya inumin yung sobrang matapang na kape. But I love the smell of coffee. I love, alam mo, nung hindi isik yun. I would spend a day just being in Starbucks or any coffee shop, sitting down, writing down stuff, journaling, or planning out my day, planning out my week and months, you know, with the costumes. Ah, I'm so happy. 22. Biggest insecurity ko, physically, ah, physically, ay ang aking braso. Yan. Confident lang ako ngayong video na ito kasi mukhang payat yung braso. Buka lang. Pero, it's not payat. Pero, insecurity ko siya ever since I was young. I would remember from time to time that yung tita, mga tita ko, or people would tell me how big my braso is. Para daw, sabi ng mga sisters ko, ito daw yung pangyayasagi ko sa mga mananakit sa akin. Hindi daw ito but in braso ko. So, yun yung biggest insecurity ko. And because of that, mas elan akong nagsasando sa labas. Pero recently lang, kaya ko na. Pero before, hindi ko talaga kaya. Kahit ang banda na kilikili ko, guys. Maputi. <laughs> Pero, I learned to love my flaws. And you guys should also. 23. Good morning person. Um, I used to be a night owl. But when I started working, I became a morning person. I love doing things in the morning. I feel productive. Parang mas marami ako na-accomplish. If I start my day 9 or 8, nang settled na lahat, fix all my schedule, and then mag-rest na lang ako pagdating ng 3, hindi ako mag magbabadali sa work or whatever. Lalo na kasi recently, nung na-lockdown ako sa bahay, ng, sa bahay ni nila mom, katabi ko yung baby sister ko. So, gumigising yung 6.30 or 6, minsan 5.30. Gigisingin ako, papaluin ako, susukin ako, ganyan. So, nasanay ni katawan ko. 24, second to the last. Okay, I'm not a music person. When I say I'm not a music person, hindi ko alam yung mga notes, ganyan. Familiar lang ako, pero ayun. I used to be in choir nung grade school. Pero pagdating ng high school, nag-audition ako. Tapos, naalala ko yun, yung teacher ko, si Miss, nagka-piano siya. Tapos sabi niya, sundan mo yung piano with your voice. Tapos, sarap ko, Ah, uh, <laughs> Hindi talaga, guys. Hindi nag-work? Hindi. A year before that, nung nag-audition ako sa Greek Club no high school, pumanta pa ako sa Dusit Hotel tsaka sa MOA. Ganun levels yung pag-acquire ko nung grades. Pero dream ko, dream ko na matuto kong pumanta or to play any instrument, kahit guitar, piano, ukulele, masena ko. Back 25. I'm a sinner, saved by me. Yes, I'm a Christian, and I believe in Jesus Christ. So, yes. 
So guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Thank you for watching this video, guys. Sobrang nahihiya pa rin ako in front of this camera. For how many years? Your five years na ako nag-work. Five years na ako nasa likod ng camera. Five years na ako taga-edit. Five, five years na ako taga-shoot, taga-conceptualize. But hindi ako masyadong humaharap sa camera. But this time, it's on. I'm journeying to this new adventure. Journey with you guys in this channel. And if you have suggestions or anything, just comment below. And I hope that you subscribe, like, Comment and subscribe to my YouTube channel.